In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to insert and extract clips in Premiere Pro. Now, if you come over here on your program monitor, you will find this tool here. This is the lift tool and this is the extract tool. To activate this tool, what you need to do is to set in and out point. So I'm going to come over to this portion here and hit I on my keyboard and come over to this portion over here and hit O on my keyboard. And this is me setting the areas that I'll be lifting and extracting. Now that we have set our in and out points, if I come over here and select lift, you will notice that Premiere Pro has lifted up this portion of clips over here. Now if I move over to a blank portion and I place my playhead over here, and I hit Ctrl V to paste, you'll notice that those clips have been added over here. So what Lift does is that it cuts the clips in that portion. Now, if I come back to this other portion over here, you'll notice that it did not cut out the clips from Track Layer 2 and Video Track Layer 3. The reason for that is that these track layers here have not been selected. So I'm going to hit Ctrl Z to restore my clips over here. Now, if I come over here and select this video track layer 2 and video track layer 3, you'll notice that those two track layers now have been highlighted. Now, if I come over here and select lift, you'll notice that it completely cuts out all those track layers. Let me move my slider. If I come over here and hit Ctrl V, you'll notice that it extracted the entire track layer. Once again, I'm going to hit Ctrl Z to restore my clips over here. Also with the extract tool, begin by setting in and out points. Now if I deselect video track layer 2 and video track layer 3 and I come over here and select extract, you'll notice that it completely cut out all the clips in that layer, irrespective of the video track layer 2 and 3 not selected. And also you'll notice that it deleted the gap, so it functions like a ripple delete tool. But if you want to extract some layers without affecting some other layers, what you need to do is to come over here and lock that particular layer. So for example, if I come over here and I set my in points and I come over here and I set my out points, notice that I have locked my video track layer 2. So my video track layer 1 and my audio track layer 1 is exposed. So if I come over here now and select extract track is going to ripple delete from video track layer 1 and audio track layer 1 without affecting my video track layer 2. And that's it guys on how to lift and extract in Premiere Pro.